okay student in this uh, lecture video lecture we see factor factor relationship okay and in this already we see factor factor relationship uh, in part first we deal with the definition meaning and a very important concept about isocont properties of isocont okay now in part second we deal with important point about types of factor factor relationship okay now many types of production surfaces are possible depending upon the underlying production function the shape of isocont and production surface will depend on the manner in which the variable inputs are combined to produce a particular level of output broadly these are three categories of such combination of inputs in that first category is fixed proportion combination of input second one constant rate of substitution and varying rate of substitution now fixed proportion combination okay these represent such products that can be produced if inputs are added in fixed proportion at all level of production okay in this case there is no substitution between inputs okay in underline this point in fixed proportion combination there will be no substitution between inputs and thus there is strict complementary relationship between two inputs already in first part i also explain two important concepts substitutes and complements okay so here in this fixed proportion combination we observe which type of relationship between two inputs complementary such an isocont implies that one exact combination of input will produce particular level of output the input which increase the output only when combined in fixed proportion is called as complementary inputs so underline the definition of complementary inputs ha huh? so example of one tractor and one man or one driver so this is included in fixed proportion combination so this is the type of input input relationship here we see we observe complementary relationship between two inputs and when there will be complementary relationship between two inputs then see the shape of isocont here x1 on ox axis quantities of x2 and see the uh, shape of isocont okay so it is a straight line hmm? right angle is it right okay now see second type constant rate of substitution in such type of factor factor relationship gives linear isocont okay linear means straight line the substitution occur at constant rate because the amount of one input replaced by other input does not change as the added input increases now see here uh, relationship is expressed uh, in equation form change in so that triangle represents change between your x21 input and change in x11 input and both the changes between all the input combinations remain same so there will be equal sign change in x22 upon change in x12 is equal to up to change in x2n upon change in x1n okay so this is called as the constant rate of substitution between two inputs and when there will be the constant rate then we see isocont is always linear and see the shape of isocont linear isocont straight line okay now here i also mention one example uh, so that uh, you easily understand this type x2 represents female labor and x1 uh, this input represents male labor see here quantities of x2 goes on decreasing and quant quantities of x1 goes on increasing so here we estimate change in x2 up and change in x1 change means the uh, difference between two figures okay that is called as the rate of change and for first one it is uh, you make it dash but on second onwards we see the change is remains constant in x2 input and change uh, is also remains constant in x1 input so if we estimate mrs so what is the formula of estimating mrs of x1 and x2 change in x2 upon change in x1 
then we see the mrs is also remains constant 2 2 2 at every combination it remains constant so we can see such type of constant rate of substitution also between two inputs now we see varying rate of substitution so in varying rate it 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 includes two types increasing rate or decreasing rate okay of substitution in this mrs of x1 and x2 varies over isoproduct curve it means the amount of one input x1 required to substitute for one un input unit of another input x2 at a given level of production so increase or decrease as the amount of x1 used to increase okay it may increase or decrease so substitution at decreasing rate is common in agriculture see here this point is very important if the two inputs substitute at which rate decreasing rate then this is common in our agriculture production so see here what happens in decreasing rate see this example here uh, x1 uh, quantities of x1 is given and quantities of x2 input is given so here change in x2 uh, is 7 6 5 4 1 so change is goes on decreasing okay and here change remains constant and if we take the mrs and what is the formula for mrs change in x2 upon change in x1 then it also goes on decreasing see here 7 6 5 4 1 so this is called as decreasing rate of substitution hmm? and when we observe decreasing rate then we see the shape of isoquant is convex to origin okay so this is the point related to varying rate of substitution in that we go in detail about the decreasing rate of substitution okay thank you